exporting and importing between virtual worlds, and saving objects to inventory. I've gone into the Impudence Viewer and signed in as our lead developer, Patrick T. Liam, and I right-clicked the building that he created and pulled out, and I'm going to More, More, and then going to Export. And I'm exporting to a place in my uh, computer where I will be able to save the house. And I'm giving it a name, clicking Save. And the notice comes up that it's only going to save textures and items that were actually created by Patrick T. Liam. I'm going over to Kitely where I previously set up a world and I'm simply moving into that world and once I'm in the world I'm going to use that same Imprudence Viewer to allow me to upload the object that I had created and downloaded from Patrick T. Liam. Once you're in the world itself you go to File import object and then you go to the location that you just saved and you click open and while you wait and while the loud noise happens your object is imported and you should be sure now you can see the import going on here you should be sure to save that object into your inventory over here so that you can um, use it in multiple locations it's resing itself right over here and it's very close to being ready. Okay, and you'll see that the object itself has very large posts on which it's riding, so I'm going to back up a little bit so you can see it. But here's the A-frame and you've now resed that as well and you have that to save. Once my object is now resed or built, I can edit it and it's a good idea to put in a descriptive name because it comes in with a generic name, so I'm calling it A-frame. And then I am going to right click and I could either take it, which would remove it entirely from the island, or I can go to more and I can take a copy of it. And I'll check my inventory and you'll now see that I have a copy of an A-frame and let me close this one if I like. I could pull out another copy. And once it's out, I would simply right click to edit and let's move this out of the way. I can adjust it as an object. I can hit control and kind of rotate it. And as with any other object, I could unlink it. I could uh, do all sorts of things with it. Um, but I now have a second copy and I can make as many A-frames as I want.